Well, as you can tell, that was a tough one. I couldn't make heads or tails out of much of anything over there, Brigham. Ten forty or one forty two. Yeah, there's a buzz in there. I see it on the scope. It might be coming from that new amplifier I had to put in. <clears throat> I had to uh well, I do see it. Huh. Yeah, I, I think it's this new amplifier I put in here. It's um it's a little sweet tube amp that I had to use because my other one went belly up. And, uh... Hmm. I see it on the scope. <clears throat> it's not usually there. You know, nothing I can move around here. It's not... It's not in the studio. <clears throat> it's, uh... I believe it's actually coming from the amplifier itself. Not, uh, not something I can change over here on this end. I have to go next door in the other room there and take a look at it. But yeah, there's definitely a hum in there, Brayton. there is prominent <laughs> you know what I'm gonna go figure it out <clears throat> I'm gonna go see if I can um... well, let me see here let me let me go bypass some... I'm gonna stay cleaned up here for a second I want to watch the scope while I do this hold on a second let me turn the audio off that box it's an old box um something that has been sitting down here for a long time so it had to run in a long time so i would imagine the electrolytics are probably not too happy at the moment so i'm pretty sure something has gone belly up on it i appreciate that 142 motor mouth ball cruising right there right now i actually i might have to might look for another driver. Um, my little skull cracker died on me. Well, he didn't die. It works fine. But the king circuit went belly up. So I guess that's what I'm going to do right now. I think I'm going to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to fix the king circuit on the skull cracker. And, uh... So I guess the skip then went away. Who's calling me? The skip then went away in, in uh, the shaky. Out west in the shaky. Beast dropping a hammer right here, right now, and I, I can't even. No, the skip ain't went away. Oh, Motor Mouth Mall had them long key downs out there. 445, letting you know. I mean, it's good. Who's gone, man? Yeah, I'll get out of his way because he's gonna, yeah. Get off. Bye, bye, bye. 
Actually, I'll tell you what I'm going to do to make sure it's not a, a, a um, another source of a, a ground loop or something. Let me, um, I'll turn on the other driver box. Hey, uh, do me a favor, kill Cornbread 445, radio man, wave down him. are off. And this one is off. <clears throat> and I hear a buzz. So it's definitely in the little box. Yep, the 60 cycle hung. I'm pretty sure it's the filter caps, <clears throat> but I'm going to try plugging it into a different outlet. I'm going to try a different outlet and um, let's see what that does. It's not a grounded plug, so I can't uh, I can't lift the ground on it. But um, let me take a look at that. I'll be back. still there. Uh, even we did it in a different outlet. <clears throat> still humming, humming away in there. What are you doing, Cornbread? I picked up one corner of it and kind of let it down kind of hard, not too hard, just to see if something was loose in there. Same thing with my, um, I've got a, a couple of, um, I've got four of the, uh, <laughs> um, Heath kit, uh, A9Bs or A-9-ABs, nine dash, nine dash whatever they're called. Yeah, I got five of them, I got one of them down here. They're called, uh, a dash Nine B's. Anyway, they're called the Heath Kid A-9 B's. And I got one of them that does that. <laughs> Give it a little bit of a tap every so often. 
Your little buzz goes away. Two take care seven threes. Now I'm gonna go turn this gate off and uh, go uh, go take a look at those two boxes and troubleshoot it and get them both going and hopefully get the buzz out of this one and get the uh, get the king circuit in the other one bypassed. I'm gonna go ahead and put a hook uh, on it and hook it up to the sequencer instead of using the RF to key it. And I'll be back where I was one way or the other. All right, catch you later on, 7-3s. 142, Motormouth Mall, looking around Austin, Texas. We got down, breaker, breaker. Ten four one forty seven uh, 142. And I'm going to step wide to the side and... One more playback real fast here before I go. All right, Motor Mountain Mall, got all that, uh, got all of that one. So, uh, have yourself a good one, man. Uh, enjoy talking to you as usual. Anyway, 73 to you at 142, we're clear. Ooh, yeah. Audio is flat bodacious. All right, catch you later. 73, Motor Mountain Mall, stepping. Four. Very good.